Hey guys, Chris from Hockey Tutorial here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the My Passer One Timer Training Aid from Hockey Revolutions. Essentially, this is a puck bouncer that's going to be able to help you develop a lot of skills away from the ice. Hockey Revolutions, the company that make this one timer, are quickly becoming one of our favorite off ice manufacturers because they're based in Europe, which means for once, us Europeans don't have to sell our organs to be able to pay for the shipping costs to be able to bring these training aids into the country. So we're going to be taking a look at how this is going to help us develop off of the ice. And by we, I mean the guys behind the camera that you never get to see. We're going to be showing you how this works, what it's going to help you develop, and most importantly, what we think about it. Hope you enjoy this video and let's get into it. In terms of the construction of the MyPasa, it's very straightforward, but it's very durable and it does the job. It's built to last. You can stand on this thing, you can move it around, but because of the size of this particular one that we're looking at over here, which is 60 centimeters in length and 7.5 centimeters in depth, you can put this into your hockey bag if you want to take it for training. I like it because you can use this for warm-ups before games and training, which is just nice. It just adds to how much use you're going to be able to get out of this one. My first thought when I picked up the My Passer was this thing is light. Now, obviously, the first thing that I was worried about was if I was going to be using real pucks with it, did that mean that it was going to shift back every time a real puck hit it? This is an issue that I've had using other puck bouncers, and it's the reason that we don't use them so much in our videos because it can get very annoying when you're filming or practicing by yourself, firing pucks at a passer, and the passer's shifting back every single time you hit it with a puck. Now, we didn't have that with the My Passer, not at all. It's incredibly light, but it's very durable and very, very stable. It has special adhesive tabs that you'll be able to stick down on any surface. And when you look at them, you don't think that it's gonna be able to hold this thing in place while it's getting pounded by pucks, but it does. And when I say you can stick this thing onto any flat surface, I mean seriously, any flat surface, even the side of a wall. So if you know Spider-Man and he likes hockey, he could even use one of these things because it'll stick to anything. And I accidentally found out while I was using the My Passer in the studio that we're in right now, I took it off of our dry land tiles just while I was rearranging some things and stuck it onto the carpet just to get it out of the way. And when I tried to pick it up, it was stuck down onto the carpet. And that's not even using the adhesive tabs. That's just using the Velcro tab on the other side of the adhesive tabs. It, it wouldn't move. So I set it up again, set it up straight, shot some pucks at it on carpet and it wouldn't move. So you can use this thing on any flat hard surfaces and if you want to, you can even use it on a carpet. So it's easily one of the most versatile puck bouncers that we've ever come across. And it's why we love it. Although the My Passer is intended for off ice use, we attached some spikes that we had to it and found that we could use it on the ice without any issues. They also have a slightly longer one, which is a My Passer Pro, which is 79 centimeters, and it has the exact same depth, 7.5. So again, that's something you could also pack into your hockey bag and take with you to training or practices. But aside from that, the great thing about having the slightly longer version is that would be great for younger kids who have a bigger target to be able to try and bounce the puck against, or it'll be great for teams for creating drills if you're gonna be doing things off and on the ice with multiple people using the passer at the same time. But that's not to mention that this smaller one over here can still easily be used by two people, but it's great to see that they have another option in case you want to do slightly more things with your passer. On the body of the My Passer, you'll notice an arrow that shows you the direction that it should be used in. But just as a side note, you can actually use this thing from both directions. You can create really fun games or drills that are gonna help you work on your passing accuracy and just ability to stick handle off the ice. This particular video is gonna be part of a series that we're doing on Hockey Revolution's training products. So make sure that you watch. You can see in the Hockey Tutorial Studio right now, I'm sitting on the tiles that we have from them. We're gonna be looking at the tiles and also some of the other training aids that they have. So make sure you stay tuned for those videos. But if you wanna see more and you wanna pick yourself up one of these My Passers, there'll be a link down below in the video description to where you can get them in Europe, which means cheap shipping, which is awesome. As always, thank you very much for watching this video. Make sure you check out the links along the side there so you can see more Hockey Revolutions training products. Hit the button down below to subscribe. And as always, keep watching, keep following. Before you go, subscribe so you can stay up to date with everything that we post.